would you consider a bad relationship? Um, abusive, so um, if it's if someone's being hurt by another person, whether it's verbally or physically, just someone that makes another person feel uncomfortable or vulnerable. I definitely see that an imbalance of power yeah. is definitely in a bad relationship. Someone can dominate and the other person will feel extremely small and vulnerable and that is definitely not something that is in a healthy relationship. To be a bad relationship if one person's uncomfortable in any way. Yeah, to me a healthy relationship also has like different opinions and different interests because otherwise it's quite um, like a almost boring relationship but it's nice to have differences within yeah, yeah. like your relationships like not having friends who do the exact same things and can introduce you to new things as well. Yeah. So. I feel like it doesn't matter who you're with or how long you have been with that person, any relationship that is currently at a healthy stage can turn into an unhealthy relationship mm. um, and like everyone has been saying, the imbalance of power mm. is very important. What would you advise a friend to do if they were in a bad relationship? I think there are people that you can contact, so um, the NSPCC, any other charities, sometimes the police, it's really important. Mm. Talking to a family member, a close friend yeah. who you can trust. Yeah. Um, the, I think the point is to get out of an unhealthy relationship. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the only way an unhealthy relationship can be resolved, I think, or well, at least the main way, is just to talk. Yeah. They always say a problem shared is a problem halved, so if you're keeping all those feelings bottled yeah. up inside of it, it's just eating away and making you feel less and less comfortable. I mean, uh, everyone always has a good safety net, uh, the, whether it's their family or their friends or just someone really close to them yeah. that they understand and know that they actually understand them and to confide in them is really important. I think what's really important is to have the knowledge that if you do get out of an unhealthy relationship, it's not your fault, yeah. that um, you should not blame yourself for the actions of that person.